Hello, this is Arnav Chaudhary and you are on my YouTube channel, Arun Foot. Today, I want to continue my series on introducing the 13 Indian Super League teams going into the 2024-2025 season. And today, it is promoted Kolkata Giants Mohammedan Sporting Club who will make their debut in the ISL this year. Mohammedan Sporting have had a lot of ins and outs, uh, a lot of changes because... Um, they now have to get ready to top flight football. And if we look at the departures, we start with influential striker Eddie Hernandez, who's gone back to Honduras to Olancho FC. Evgeny Kozlov, the Russian attacker, goes to Shakhtar Karaganda. David Lansanga goes to East Bengal FC. Samuel Lamun Puya goes to Aizol FC. Juan Neyar has also left the club. William goes to Diamond Harbour FC. James Stoksom James Singh, as well as Sajal Bak, gone loan to Delhi FC. Tanmay Ghosh goes on loan to Rajasthan United. And when we look at the incomings, well, there are quite a few. The most important is that of Brazilian winger Franca, who joins from Bulgarian giants Lokomotiv Sofia. Cesar Lobi Manzuki joins from Hatta Club from the UAE Pro League. Mohamed Kadiri joins from Aras Naz Shivan from the Azerbaijan Premier League. Joe Zoheliana as well as Kale Ran in Fela join from Isol FC. And Jerry, Jeremy Lal Din Puya joins from Real Kashmir FC. On the other side, Amajit Kiam joins from FC Goa, the former India junior captain. Robinson Singh joins from Trao. Bhaskar Roy joins from Mumbai City FC. Gaurav Bora as well as uh, Rocha Zela from Northeast United. Lal Rem Sangha from Rajasthan United. Makan Winkle Chote as well as Sajat Hussain Parai from Hyderabad FC as well as Pau Gumang Singson from Odisha FC. So a mix of players with experience from the ISL and from the I-League. When we look at the overall squad, we start with the keepers. Padam Chetri, one of the reasons why Mohamedan Sporting got promoted. A great season the keeper has had. Nikhil Deka as well as Mashka Roy are his understudy. When we look at defence, we have to look no further than Joseph Atzai. The Ghanaian... Yeah, had a solid season last year and has been retained. He'll be joined in defence by Gaurav Bora, Zubing Liana Ralte, Deepu Haldar, Mohamed Irshad, the tall, solid centre-back from Kerala, is also in there in the mix, as well as Joe Zoher Liana, Samad Ali Molik, is captain of the team, uh, Vannal Suidika as well as Mohamed Jasim could be useful on the wings as could be Sajad Hussein Parai. When we look into midfield, Mir Yalol Kasimov, the Uzbek midfielder, influential last season as well. He has been retained and is joined by Amarjit Singh Kiam. He's joined by Jeremy Laldin Puya, Lalrin Fela is, in, is a midfielder potentially there as well. And... Um, Angusana could be also an option. Now, when we talk about attackers or strikers, we'll have to talk about Franca from Brazil and last season's influential player, Alexis Gomez from Argentina. Cesar Lobi Manzoki also adds firepower up front as does Lalrim Sanga Fanai. So, Mohamed Sporting have an interesting mix of experience and talented player. And they will be continued to be coached by Andrei Shanishov, the Russian who coached them to promotion. Now, Mohamedan open their season on Monday, September 16th against Northeast United. Northeast United returned to the city where they just recently won the Duran Cup. So not an easy one. And um, then Mormon Sporting on September 21st, on the Saturday, host FC Goa. 
Well then, on September 26th, on the Thursday, they travelled to face Chennai FC. Three not so easy matches for Marvin and Sporting, so they have to adjust to life in the ISL very, very quickly. And an interesting information is that the Kishore Bharati Kirangan will be their home in the ISL. Yeah, it's not going to be the Salt Lake Stadium, but rather the Kishore Bharati Kirangan. And um, interesting to see how they make that a fortress and difficult to beat. What do you think about Mormon and Sporting joining the Indian Super League? Let me know in the comments below and let me also know if I've missed anything or should have added something. As always, like, share and subscribe here on YouTube, Aaron Foot. My other social medias, aaronfoot.com. And I'll be back very soon. So now we're Chaudhary signing off. Bye for now.